All right, Corona update. Yeah. Um, before I, another one. Okay, so everybody, uh, UPS and FedEx is all leaving like the, the the their hubs right now. All going to get gas. We were just at the gas station, and there was like four or five UPS trucks, and two more pulled in when we left. Um, or FedEx trucks. Big squad. But big squad. But um, no, I'm not sick. This is just a precaution. Today is March 30th. I checked. And uh, we're gonna go pick up a car, hopefully, that I have wanted for a long time. It is a 2004 Forester XT, that's a turbo, five-speed manual, Java Black Pearl, uh, engine's been fully rebuilt, it's got a nice set of wheels, it's on coils, it's got a full exhaust, it's got an oversized intercooler, stage two tune, the works, yada yada. Um, we get it, we'll see it, I'm super excited. I've been talking to this guy for a little bit. I actually tried to buy this car uh, a little over a year ago, and I just wasn't quick enough by the time I would have had the cash, and he sold it to his buddy. This is the guy that built it. He sold it to his buddy, and now his buddy's ready to sell it because he's got other projects going on. So hopefully we can go snag this from him. Uh, I'll discuss price and stuff like that later if you want to know. Um, but I'm excited. This should be a fun little road trip. Uh, we're going right into New Hampshire, right back. Andrew's probably not even going to leave the car. I'm, I'm going to get out, I'm going to look at it, make the deal with him, keep this on, come right back. Should be good. Yeah, so, I, I figured if I ended up leaving the car, it would be at that distance. Yeah. Standing. So, yeah, no, it won't, should be too bad. We're not, we're not going to just walk over, fucking shake hands, make out. Like, no, <laughs> I make out. That, unless that's a Subaru thing I don't know about, but. Somebody's going to make the joke. Um, <laughs> it's my goddamn truck. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, no, so this will be cool. Um, I don't know, anything else? I'm not wearing a mask because I'm probably the only other healthy person who does have a mask. Yeah, well, but, you but know. He's got it on, so we're like. It is what it is. Social distancing at a close distance. Oh, filtered social distancing. Filtered. So yeah. I haven't seen Jackson in like two weeks, just so you guys know. Oh, yeah, dude, I haven't been anywhere really. Like, all my friends, my fucking girlfriend, like, it sucks. I don't think they but, believe that we ever leave each other. Two weeks I haven't seen this first time. Yeah. So it happens. We don't see each other sometimes. Believe it. I needed a break though. No, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he started this just so he could get away. Yeah, from I, I created the coronavirus to distance myself from Andrew because he wouldn't leave me alone. <laughs> he, he followed me around after high school and it just he wouldn't leave me alone. No. Um so yeah, we'll we'll update as necessary or as anything cool happens. We're not gonna really make any stops, so I don't know what's in store for video wise but i'll try to film the car a little bit and then uh see what we do on the way home probably film it when i get home covid report with andrew lewis um all right so we just entered new hampshire we're in uh was it freedom freedom new hampshire i think uh live free just crossed the line i don't know um just figured i'd record because the only interesting thing i've seen for a little while so why not you know a uh, little one lane here Temporary intersection. I am sure that they absolutely love that. It didn't. It didn't come out a second ago. I put it third. Here we go. There it goes. Just cheap things. Just cheap things. Hey, look at all the green. Yes, spring. Even though we got a bunch of snow and sleet last night. Yeah, that was kind of weird. Yeah. Dude, the speed limit is definitely not 70 miles an hour here in Mexico. But we're going 70 miles an hour. Fuck them. Yeah. And on that note. Alright, so I really didn't document much of the uh, interactions with the guy or checking out the car. It needs work. It really needs work. But I got him down to. Oh my god, it sounds so bad. Uh, I got him down to two grand, and I bought it. I'm driving it home. Uh, it's a lot rougher than I thought it was. Um, but the motor sounds healthy. Um, you know, it runs nice. The transmission needs work. I don't know if it needs a clutch or if the trans itself needs to either be rebuilt or replaced at some point. It shifts into all gears fine. It just grinds a little into third if you don't give it a second. Um, so probably synchros, I believe. I don't know. I'm not a trans guy. Um, just getting started with all this. Um, but it's 
rubbing every time you turn left I it, it sounds like a grinding but I don't think it's like axle bind I think uh, I think these are just cheap ass coilovers and the way that those are designed the bottom part of the coilover is rubbing against the axle so um, fingers crossed we make it home without breaking an axle um, I just filled up with gas gas gauge works intermittently it's working right now it says we're full I believe it because it clicked off a couple times so we'll see how it goes fingers crossed we just make it home and we'll update you we'll do a full walk walk around to the car get you some exhaust clips everything you guys want to see um, right now focus is just getting it home so peace okay this is too good I don't know if you can see it in my rear view but there's a black, a Java black, uh, same color as this, same everything, Forrester XT behind me. It's kind of great. Oh, I got a shift. <laughs> I'm hoping he'll maybe want to catch up, maybe I can get a better shot, but that's great. I pulled up to the light behind Andrew, turned onto this road, and he's sitting across from us at the light. <laughs> same color, Forrester XT. It's awesome. I'm stoked. I love seeing other Foresters on the road. I don't know. It's just a, it's a car thing. Andrew's the same with Commanders if you haven't noticed. You know, that's just how it is. Final Corona update for the video. I'm not sick, but this is... <laughs> fuck yeah, dude. Love this thing. Dirty as fuck right now. I just made a... Let's see, actually. What? How... 121.4 mile journey home. No problems. Well, one problem, but not a problem problem. I, I said it in the clip that I recorded earlier. You've already heard it. Andrew hasn't because he was in that. Yeah, what um, happened? Just explaining the... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it's doing some shit. But no, I, I started recording. You see the, the Java Black XT across from us at the intersection when we turned on the 302? Yeah, yeah he was right behind me. I recorded him like, hey, squad. <laughs> Same car. Yeah, awesome. yeah, it was funny. You know, it's funny. I haven't seen really many cops in two weeks. I saw Oh, Sam dude, these brakes are bad. <laughs> Look at the rotor. Look at the rotor. Well, those are kind of aids. Yeah. Yeah, no. Oh, it's not bad. All right, well, yeah. So $2,000 later, he had it posted for 35 I told him I'd give him 28 if I brought my own wheels. Uh, then I kind of bluffed him, told him 25 I had 25 I was just waiting to get the last 300 and he said he'd take 25 So then we're talking, trying to make the deal work. And he's like, it's, it's been raining. He's like, you know what? You can just take it on these wheels. I don't really care about them. So now I got it for 25 on these wheels. Go there today. And it's just issue after issue. This, I'll, I'll, put it, I'll be honest, this thing needs a lot of love. But, you know, the motor's strong. It's a good project. It's it is a good project. And it's going to be a content queen. There's going to be a lot of stuff to do to this. A lot of stuff for you guys to watch. It's got, um, it's got a lot of stuff like me and you wanted to learn how to do. Yeah. Yeah, I got to do a catch can setup on it. I got to put the downpipe in. Um, I want to put. I want to do a subframe, a rear subframe eventually, because I have all aftermarket. I don't know rear, how to do that, but I could rear learn. control arms. I did it on my red one. This will come out actually really easy. This right here, that would probably come. Right if we, out. yeah, if we can get back there. He thinks one of his kids did this. <laughs> really? Yeah, just kicked it because he said that looks like a shoe. <laughs> that's nice. I was um, like, oh, that's sweet. Oh yeah, dude, look. This is the original light because all three of these tabs are broken. They're in the. Oh, so the light wasn't replaced. Yeah, so okay, so that wasn't... There? I have no idea. Somebody must have cornered something just perfectly Yeah, right honestly, here. I don't know. And it buckled um, So rear quarters both need work. Um, as you can see, that doesn't quite line up. Damage there. Um, this front fender needs to be replaced at some point. Um, this looks like somebody sides this. Yeah, honestly, it, it, they, they bash something, because look at the fucking bumper, too. Yeah. Um, but no, I mean, it's, it's not a bad little car. It just made the journey no problem. Um, I checked the oil. Oil's black, but good. I uh, checked the coolant. Coolant's bright green. So fluids looked all right. Um, just did an alternator today. I guess whoever built this didn't have time to get the right alternator. So uh, they apparently cut the plug. We never plugged it in. How did it make the whole way here? Uh, okay, so <laughs> we plugged that in. Um, See if the check engine light goes away. Well, I'll probably have to drive it. What? I think it needs a motor mount. Yeah? Uh, what's more so a no it needs a motor mount, the way I just saw it. <laughs> <laughs> it just went... <laughs> <laughs> That's a Subaru motor for you. Here, get a little, get a couple. Uh... 
You want me to go back here? Go up there first. All right, all right, all right. This one sounds like a Subaru more like than your last one. Yeah, uh, according to the guy in the Mercedes, it sounds like a pile of dog shit. So the other one was a little intense. Yeah, no. Yeah. <laughs> I did. What, what was I gonna do? Fix it? I was getting rid of it. That's true. Well, I'll, I'll have to drive it. I might go out to Tyler's and see if it goes away. But I can't believe we didn't plug it in. So that was get this right. This was like a two-hour and twenty-minute ride home. That the alternator wasn't plugged in. It was connected to the battery. So as far connected. as the car was concerned, there was no alternator in it. Interesting. The car was like, I don't have an alternator, and just kept going. Like well, it, I'm gonna see if this goes out. I think Tyler has a code reader. I have one oh, right here. Are on. I have a code reader. Oh, do you? Yeah. All right, let me plug it in. Yeah, your fog I lights look pretty kind of decent. Okay, because I haven't seen any of the lights work. Uh, they all worked. I I checked while you was driving because I was gonna call you if it didn't work. Did you? Did you check the rears when I passed you? Or? Wow, that's impressive. <laughs> yeah, no, she needs a deep cleaning and a handful of other things, but this is gonna be a fun car. Hell yeah, Captain uh, Walmart code reader. What, this isn't oh, Walmart? oh, dude! What? One of the studs is snapped on the coil over. <laughs> Um, yeah, funny. he said they're not eBay bull. Dude, you know what I was about to say though? What? He said they're not eBay. I swear to God, they're eBay. He said they're not, but they ride like butter. They ride better than my BCs. I don't, I don't understand how or why, but they ride a lot better than Your the BCs. BCs are did. old as shit. They're not that old. No, that's true. And they're more reputable than eBay coilovers. So, let's see. I think this is the first time a Subaru has ever been read on this. No, didn't we do my old one? Oh yeah, we did do your old one. Yeah. All right, second time. Oh, those. It only knows Jeep stuff. <laughs> A lot of Jeep stuff. Uh, read codes. Uh, pending codes. There's two. Oh, no, Fuel that's for the that's is... for the gas gauge. Fuel yeah. level sensor. So that's AIDS. All right, and what's the second one? Catalyst, Catalyst system. system okay, I don't give a fuck about that. That's every fucking Subaru. PO420. Cool. Uh, check stored codes real quick, just because. Do you love them? No. Awesome. Cool. That's an interesting clutch pedal. Oh, it's just missing the rubber thing. Yeah, I know. How does it feel? Bad. I mean, pretty it's... weak. It's pretty weak. The clutch in my in my other I, car was stronger. I guess I was expecting worse when I pushed it down. Really? I don't know. Uh, well, you're gonna have to move the seat a little close. That's well, closer. Well, I can just move my ass up like this. I can just. Oh. Okay. It was definitely the way I was sitting then. Yeah. That went to the floor with no effort. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> so. Yeah, I wonder if the key fobs work. <laughs> it, it might. It looked like. It looked like eight. <clears throat> I'm so mad. Oh my god, they work! Huh? It works! <laughs> I've never, it's been so long since I've had a car with key fobs, like it's a little thing, but that's so cool to me. <laughs> oh yeah, you don't either, you just have the key fob. I just have the fob, it doesn't Because it's work. part of the key. Alright, well, I'm going to say that concludes this video. I would uh, say so. I mean, there's going to be a shit ton of Forester content coming soon, so if you don't like it, you know? Oh well. Yeah, and there's gonna be a lot of us swearing and not knowing what we're oh, doing. Oh, dude, so just go along with it. You wanna see me get pissed, man? Stay tuned, because I guarantee you something on this is gonna break and piss me off. That's when I'll take over the camera and I'll I'm gonna, I wanna go through the uh, intake, make sure that that's all. We can all the, this, the this filter will be and everything. Easy to fix. Dude, every fucking forester I've had has broken the bolt in the radiator mount. We could fix that. But, um. I actually have a, uh. Oh, squirter, for... squirters don't work. Oh, they um, don't? Water shot out, it went but they don't spray onto the thing, so motors or the plugs or something or a fuse. Uh, that's one of the first things I do every time I get a car is I go through every single fuse. I take a probe right to all the fuses and just check, and if any of them are bad, replace them, see what happens. I'm probably going to do a DRL delete. Um, 
Yeah, oversized intercooler, go fast bits, deceptor blow off valve. That's actually a nice blow off valve, not gonna lie. Um, I don't know what this intercooler is either. I'm gonna have to research that. Um, oh, you can some, test if the one you have. Some is eBay loud. ass wheels. Uh, no, I think I need to get a new uh, snap ring for it because oh, it's okay. kind of just rotating. Oh, okay. Um, but the thing is, with these cars, you don't want to start modifying things without getting it retuned. And I don't know. Supposedly, it's stage two tuned with with just having it and not seeing it at peak performance it's not yet. Slow, I don't know. I mean. No, it's not you slow. You were keeping up just fine, and I was going hand Oh, dude, if, if I didn't have that wheel issue, I would have been right on your ass the whole way. But it, it was making turns because I don't know the full extent of what that's doing. I didn't want to pop something 100 miles from the house. So... If I can pick my head up. I yeah, already, so I can't see shit in there. Yeah, no. Low boy. I already tried. Are you going <laughs> to unlow boy it? Not like unlow low, but like raise it up just a um, little bit. So it's, it depends. I'm probably going to sell these wheels so I can fund... Um, the stuff that I need to do to it, like filler neck, get that roof rail replaced, get the gas, the sending unit. Um, I'll put my coilovers in it and try and sell these coilovers. Um, I just, I want to go through it. Uh, I'll bring it up to Jason's, have a day. I don't, I want to do plugs. I want to do oil change. Plugs are a bitch in these cars. Um, cause they're, they are. Cause they're, they're not angled like mine. They're straight against the frame rail and they're coil, oh, they they're, they're coil on plug. There's no coil pack up here uh. because there's the intercooler right there. So oh, it's kind of like my car. I want to figure out sense. if these are stock injectors or not too, because supposedly it's stage two tuned, and I think injectors are part of that. Um, I would think so. I mean, but I'm not sure. That's either that might be stage three with like a, a fuel pump or something. I don't know. I'm not a turbo guy, so Actually, not as I will hot be as learning. I thought that would be. But this car doesn't run as hot as yours does. No way in hell. No, and you know what's funny? While the gas cool. gauge was working. I get so much better gas mileage in this than I did in my 04 because I don't know what was up with that, but something was causing it to eat gas. There's a turbo in this. No, 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 no. You don't understand. <laughs> I know that much. But what I'm saying 14. is... 14.4. But what I'm saying is, with my old car, I used to get better gas mileage, and up until recently, it was shit. Yeah, it is weird. Like, if I if I was driving it for, like, the whole day, I could watch my gauge go down. That is kind of really So, weird. I don't know. But, yeah, filler neck... A uh, handful of other things. I want to get a rear bumper for it, front bumper. I'm going to clean up this grill and repaint it black because I don't know what the fuck this is, but that's retarded. Um, there's a lot of bodywork stuff I got to do. I want to do the rear quarters. You have a grill for it, don't you? Nope, that, I left it on my other car. Oh, you left it on the other car. Okay. I didn't have a replacement one, a stock one to put back on. Oh, that's right. You only I gave it, the first I gave it to, uh, the garage. I gave it to Joe to experiment with because he makes custom body stuff for JDM Emergency. Mm -hmm. But yeah, um, it's a lot of talking. If you're still listening, thank you very much. Um, it's gonna be a lot of shit coming. Uh, Andrew's getting the Camaro back soon, hopefully, so that'll yeah, be cool so as well. Maybe both these cars will be on jack stands and being worked on at some point. <laughs> yeah. Side by side, broken project, boys. So um, I don't know if I if I'm gonna start working on this today. I might. I'm probably gonna at least try to clean the interior, but I don't have a garage or anything, so I might just say fuck it and do it in the rain anyway, because that's how I am. But. You know, if that happens, then the next video you see will pick up basically right here. If not, then like, comment, subscribe. Come, just, I don't know. I, yeah, that. I lost what I was going to say. Do that. Do that. Do that.